In this video, we provide the solution to question number 12 from the practice final exam for math 1060, in which case we're asked to convert the polar coordinate 4, 11 pi over 6 into rectangular coordinates here. I should mention that this problem we've seen several times throughout the semester, converting from polar coordinates to rectangular coordinates uh, is similar to working with a complex number and its polar form or working with a vector, either an algebraic or geometric representations. So if we're in polar coordinates here, this means that our radius is 4 and our angle here is 11 pi over 6. So the x coordinate is just going to be r cosine theta. So we end up with 4 times cosine of 11 pi sixth, like so. Similar for the y coordinate, uh, the y coordinate is going to be r sine theta. So we end up with 4 times sine of 11 pi sixth which we should mention 11 pi 6 references pi 6, but it's in the fourth quadrant. So cosine will be positive. So we get 4 cosine of pi 6. Pi 6 is the same thing, of course, as 30 degrees. Uh, but in the fourth quadrant, sine would be negative. So we get negative 4 sine of pi 6, like so. At pi 6 or 30 degrees, sine gives us 1 half. So we get negative 4 over 2, which is negative 2. Uh, but cosine of pi 6 will give us root 3 over 2. So we end up with 2 root 3. And so our coordinates should be positive 2 times root 3, comma, negative 2. And so we see the correct answer is, in fact, A.